a wire of length L and a resistance 100 ohm divided into 10 equal parts. The first 5 parts are connected in series while the next 5 parts are connected in parallel. The two combinations are again connected in series. The resistance of this final combination is given wire of length is L and resistance is equals to 100 ohm. Now this resistor of length L is divided into 10 equal parts. Each of resistance becomes to 100 by 10. 10 ohms. So each part of resistance is 10 ohm. Now first 5 parts connected in series. When 5 resistors are connected in series, then equivalent resistance is equals to number of resistors into resistance of each resistor. Here all the resistors of resistance is the same. Multiply with n. Here n is equals to 5. 5 into 10, 50 ohm. So first 5 parts resistance 50 ohm when connected in series. Now the next 5 resistors are connected in parallel. When resistors of equal resistance connected in parallel, then the formula for the equivalent resistance is equals to R by N. Here N is equals to 5. Resistor of each resistance is 10 ohm and N equals to 5. So equivalent resistance when connected in parallel is equals to 2 ohm. Again these two resistors are connected in series. The final equivalent resistance is equals to Rs plus Rp. 50 plus 2 is equals to 52 ohm. Second option is correct.